Right guys, the long awaited Bromley Police Station. I'm back on a revisit. Uh, there's the gentleman inside. The last time I come here, they illegally detained me guys under section one of PACE with a man I will not mention, the weirdo Ryan. We got detained just down here and I haven't been here for well over a year. I put the complaints in and I haven't heard anything. And it was, it was a simplistic thing. We filmed here. Just around the back here got threatened with a section 44 which has been repealed uh, under the terrorism act then we went in white chose got ourselves a soft drink so i think i had like a, a bottle of dr pepper and then they all swarmed on us and detained us under section one of pace illegally and it is pending guys so in the description for this video will be that video and um i'm here on my own because i was with aj audits and that weird O'Brien. And it was right here where I got detained. Illegally, of course. And it was all because I was filming the back gate, like I'm going to now. And they're trying to lie and say I was looking into cars. Bullshit. Absolute bullshit. That's what it is, guys. Just abusing their powers and uh, illegally detaining people as they like to do. So we are here on a return. I want to see how they treat me today here at Bromley really really annoyed me guys this was like shortly after I kind of give up auditing had that break so it was July 2022 when I audited this last and I got detained right there so what I, what I would love to see is them two officers that detained me and uh, admit they done wrong because the amount of videos I've done since I've not seen these officers about and I would like to see the justification for that detainment and enough grounds isn't just filming the police station yeah because I literally filmed here got a 10 minute interaction went in there got a bottle of Dr Pepper and then bang got us here detained us here illegally under section 1 of PACE right there so it feels good to be back. What we're going to do, we're going to go in the front counter and then obviously come towards the back again. But it's very, very narrow here, guys, just to walk by. So I will pick this back up when I get to the front counter. Look at the footpath, what the police have done. So look how you've got to get through. Look at the gap. They're corrupt as anything. Corrupt as anything, man. Just move out the fucking way. Literally, I had to do some James Bond shit to get through there. Oh my God. What is wrong with them? Why do they park like this? Why are they parking like that? What's up with them? I mean, I know they illegally detained me here. But is there a need to park like that at all? <coughs> So yeah guys, this is Bromley High Street. Um, I've come here, I've just come a long, long ride from Croydon to here. And it took an hour and a half to get here, guys. So after I've done the audit here, I'm gonna walk down that high street and get out and go do another one because it's getting late, it's nearly 7 p.m. And um, we're not really gonna get much done now. Uh, how late it's become but time does sure fly you guys time does sure fly I'd love to get the officers who uh, illegally detained me on camera this time so it's all the numbers guys which is a good thing if you want to talk about all of them categories that's a really good thing it's nice to see you have a phone, you have one, two, three. Where's the knife bank? There's no knife bank here. And there's no staff beyond the counters, which I'm not surprised about. They get wind that someone's filming. They like to do a disappearing act. Um, 
and that's what it looks like at the minute. But there's a lady here, she looks quite friendly to be fair. And hopefully we can get a conversation with this lady. Oh, you're right, miss. Oh, well, a little bit frustrated. Um, I'm doing a bit of filming, it's obvious to see. Um, I was here last year. Yep. Doing a bit of filming. Oh, and um, I was doing a bit of filming. Yep. And um, I've come out of the Waitrose, right near the back of the gate of this police station. Okay. Got a drink. Uh, a couple of police officers pulled up on me. Yeah. Come out of the car. We're going to search you under Section 1 of Pace. Okay. Illegally. Trying to say I'm a thief. They're trying to say this selfie stick was a weapon. Okay. Now this is light as a feather. This ain't no weapon. And yeah, I've just come here today to um, see if them police officers were on duty. I have put complaints in about them, but I've heard nothing back. Do you know who they were? Um, I have got them on video, and I'll quickly show you now. But I'm not just explain to this lady the badge number of the police officer that detained me, and she's going to see if he's still here. Because I, I would love today to get his proper reasoning why he did it that day. Because I feel it was down to the ego uh, more than anything. Yeah, I, I bet he ain't even from here, miss. Uh, so he's safer, what we call safer transport. Uh, team. Yeah. Um, he... What rank is he, Miss? PC. PC. So he is PC Fishenden. PC Fishenden. Yeah. And I've got the correct badge number there. Yeah, so it's 1648 T for Tango. Yeah. And is he based here? Yeah. And is he on today? Uh, I don't have access to Khan, so I can go and find out. Please, Miss, because yeah. I'd love to try and get a conversation with him. Listen, I know you're busy, Miss. How you been anyway? Yeah, good, thank you. How about you? Yeah, I mean, it gives me bad memories coming back here. Cause That's I'll... not good. <laughs> no. I mean, yeah, look, you should be alright coming in here. We're friendly. But I, I've never, um, you know, getting detained, miss, yeah. simply because I filmed the, the back of Bromley. Because yeah. conveniently, after I finished filming, what, two minutes later, I come out of the shop and they're on me. It's a very obvious conclusion that the egos were a bit and they, they wanted to detain me. They didn't find nothing. And um, yeah, you know, no apology, nothing. Um, it's a joke. How long ago was this? This was July 2022, so last year, 13 months ago. Oh, well. Let me pop through and see if I can just grab a police officer just to check. You've got very neat writing, miss. Can <laughs> I just get this? Why, look how neat that writing is. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I won't be a minute. Thank you, miss, for your no professionalism. Worries. No worries. It's a very nice lady here, police staff. Um, so we're going to hopefully get this officer here today and try and get a conclusion to this because getting that section on the pace guys really made me so angry. It was so convenient that you film the police station, come out of the shop, boom, they're on you, section on the pace. Trying to call me a thief. I ain't no thief. Breaking and entering. Looking into cars. Well, that ain't no uh, proper reasoning. Excuse me? If, I, if I'm walking by and I didn't film the police station, you wouldn't search me. It was a simple thing is, I filmed the back of this police station and that's why you did it. I mean, for him to get on today would be amazing. Realistically, it probably won't happen, but we've shown our face and we will film the back again a little bit more after this. Uh, and yeah, the fifth police station of the day and it's the first time I've actually got to come in, inside one because of how busy it's been. Every single area I've been in today, everyone's been on there. Yeah, so this lady's been very professional. Oh, here we go, guys. Got a little fan there, look. So, yeah, it's coming up to nearly 7 pm, guys, so it's been a very, very long day, that's for sure. And to get here from Croydon was a hour and a half distance, long old trip. Didn't realise how big Croydon was to travel through it. That's for sure. Yeah, when I showed the lady the video, it was only a short clip, but I didn't actually show her. And then I screenshotted the badge number, so I didn't want to give away too much, guys. I feel like I'm, I'm being violated if I had to show it the channel in the video. Do you know what I mean? But yeah, there's uh, 6p anyway. If you want it, guys. <laughs> Bit of tip X. <laughs> Victim information leaflet. Yeah. And that slip I remember only too well. Still got that slip at home. 
but you illegally searched me under. Literally put the complaint in, guys, and I've heard nothing. And that's been 13 months. So that justice is not being served, man. We know this anyway. But, uh, yeah, it's really disappointing. But I've got to give, it, give them credit here today. They've been very professional. Um, I won't be taking a seat because the last time I took a seat in a PlayStation audit, um, I got trapped in. Oh, Kentish Town, Twickenham. The list is getting endless, so we're not getting trapped here today. That's for sure. The lady's obviously gonna go in and go, look, there's a guy here, not very happy about what happened to him last year. He'd like to get a conversation with you. It ain't gonna happen, but if it did, uh, you know, pigs can fly. So who knows? Pigs can fly, apparently. So we're trapped in again, are we? <sighs> yep. Give me anxiety again. I just waited in there. And there's that normal life going on by. Sunny as anything now. So Bromley High Street just over there. We will be visiting there in a minute. This UK weather's crazy, man. It can be like sunny in the morning, boiling, you can't breathe. Then it goes rainy, now it's gone sunny again. Seven o'clock at night. Just insane. Yeah, I'll pick this back up, guys, if we get some sort of conclusion there. 10 minutes later. Oh. You're right, miss. Hello. Right, so he's on leave at the moment. Oh, is he? He is back on the 16th of August. So okay. I had to get my inspector to ring through to Thank play you. safer transport. I believe you. Um, they checked on their palms, what we call palms, which is where their ship's rotors are. So he's still working then? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's had a bit of a breakdown. Okay. I'm joking. <laughs> so I hope not. Yeah, I mean, um, 16th of August, he will be on duty. And he's based here, isn't he? So he well, won't... it comes up as they're based as Bromley. Yeah. But because they're like a safer transport, they sort of float all over. Yeah. Really, yeah. Oh, well, thank you anyway, miss. Right, so... en enjoy your 6p. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers, miss. No worries. no worries. You take care of yourself. Thanks for trying anyway, and uh, we'll try again. All right, sir. So... See you later. Bye -bye. Very professional lady there, guys. So he's on annual leave. We will return here to Bromley in a future date, not necessarily the 16th of August. I mean, the lady did try a little bit there and I appreciate her for the time and effort she showed here at Bromley, guys. Um, the chapter's still not closed. We will return. Let's go to the back gate for one last time and then uh, we'll get the hell out of there. Well then guys, for a 15 minute wait here at a back gate, there's been no activity at all. Very, very strange here at Bromley today. They knew I was here. That police officer's not on annual leave. I tried my best guys. I'll catch you on the next one. Please do subscribe, we're 70 away from 17.2 thousand. The link in the description will show you my first visit here where I was illegally detained under section one of PACE literally right there oh yeah guys and in the comment section please for me put hashtag big up the gypsy i'll catch you on the next one